Hi guys and welcome to Bad Pack, Toronto's number one entertainment series. I'm your host Pat and you know it's always a pleasure sharing 30 minutes of my Friday evening with you. So keep it right here to Tobago Channel 5 because trust me, this show you won't want to miss. Let's get right into it. First up, this is our In The Mix segment where we seek to highlight various bars on the island for all types of drink surprises. As Ben's bar is where it all went down from three shots, giveaways and the special mix from the bartender. Keeps this is one of the ideal bars to hang out with friends, but be sure to have a designated driver because Backpack does not subscribe to drinking and driving. Take a look. Hey Jimmy, Jimmy. Jimmy. BSCK, PSCK, you don't know. From the time you see this face, it's rough, me. And I'm standing in front. Boom! Ben's bar. That means mixology segment. My favorite segment. Alcohol. Yeah! Right? So, in a while, we're going inside. Coming up, the cameraman will be doing all the drinking tonight. Yours truly is under some doctor's orders. Antibiotics are coming up, drinking. It live out tonight. What do we hear? We have Ben's bar, as you said. We're going inside for the mixology segment. Bar person gonna mix up two drinks as usual. Remember, it's a BACK, PACK, the fattest, hypest magazine time show on the island. Remember that. Right, mixology segment. I stand there with Cape, not Roy Cape, Barman Cape, with Ben's Bar. Mix up some fancy things, some brown looking, chocolatey looking thing. Right? Explain that drink to me and the people out there in TV land. Well, this is what you call a mudslide. Um, this is a Caribbean drink. It's very simple. This is the ingredients here. Just a little of each, and that's that. So how long are you doing this? Attending, playing chemistry. Well, not too long, about uh, nine, nine months. Nine months, so that means you're poisoning anybody yet? No, no, no. We're not here to poison anybody. We're here to make them happy, make them feel good. So, that was a lime vibe. Well, I like, I keep like coming, I mean, I like the atmosphere, the bar full, the atmosphere is nice and all that. But if you have one word to describe Ben's bar, what that would be? Just come and have fun, man. It's a place for excitement. Just come and one word, boy. just come and experience. It, it, it can't be one word. It will be more than one word because it's a lot of it's a lot of stuff to be going on here. So you have to come and see it. But I'm gonna put you on test now. The drink is just mix. I'm gonna take them to two persons outside. I'm gonna have them taste them. You on test now? Is a scale of one to ten. I hope you get my nuts. So I'm going out now. Right, you see what happened there? Ladies like free drinks. Why ladies like free drinks? Free drinks? Mm -hmm. I guess because it doesn't come out of your pocket. Women, women. It, uh, you hear that, Tobago? The drinks taste better when it's free. <laughs> so tell me the taste of that. Mmm, chocolatey, little creamy, milky. Just what I like. Yeah. In a scale of 1 to 10. Hmm, it's gonna be difficult because you see that gentleman behind there? That's a barman and that's my husband. Yes. It's gonna be difficult. So, 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 your taste buds are fired. Let me tell you. Okay. It has a really nice taste. It's not watery. I'd give him an 8 out of 10. 8 out of 10. Palo, take your forwards. 8 out of 10. 8 out of 10. I'm going to take the next drink. Right. 
Tobago, Tobago, I love this job. Tobago, this job is lovely. I'm gonna give you a taste of this. Tell me what you think with your Tobago taste buds. Good. In one word, good, that long. Really good. So if your boyfriend should bring you to Ben's bar and buy that for you, you will give him the forward. Of course. Just the forward or forward more forward? Forward more forward, of course. <laughs> Tobago, if you're out there and you need to get forwards and more forwards, <laughs> this is the bar, this is the drink. It's a backpack, it's the hottest, hypest, livest magazine type show on the island. Remember that. I'm having the most fun in the world. True that. Gentlemen, gentlemen, what is this? What is this? What is that? What is it? What is it? What is this? Yeah, man, nice. Gentlemen, Appleton. The best rum on the island. Where are you from? Trinidad. Arima. Arima. So everybody here from Arima? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And where the best part of Tobago is seen so far? The best part? Mm. Scarborough, Scarborough. Where the best part of Tobago? Grong Point. Where the best part of Tobago? Grong Point. Where the best part of Tobago? Grong Point. Point. Tobago. The best part of Tobago is the whole of Tobago. Them for us, Marima, we got to teach them. Appleton around. Gentlemen on the half of Appleton and Backpack. Enjoy the best rum in the world. Yeah? So we do here at Backpack. It's Appleton. It's with Backpack. It's crazy here. Topping the spotlight this evening in our featured auntie segment is one of Tobago's very own gospel duet. And despite the many challenges, they continue to persevere in having their music hit the airwaves as far as Jamaica. So here's more from these two beautiful young ladies in our studio. Easy in this troubled world. We're loving that we've lost, we've been holding for too long. Let's just go. Yo, Tobago, it's BACK, BACK, the hottest, hypest magazine type show on the island. You know that for sure. You know we unearthing talent from Charlottesville to Crown Point. Standing next to me is Kiki and Stephanie, two of our latest protege. Tobago, we unearthing talent for so. Do mind Stephanie, kind of nervous side of me here. Yeah, he's trembling all, trembling. It's all good. It's all <laughs> It's all good, it's all good. Right. These ladies are two new gospel artists. Has been doing quite well so far. I think um, they, they name the Christian them over in Jamaica actually. Tell me about that Jamaica thing. Let me start with Kiki. Okay, it's a uh, good Tell me your part in the whole dynamic duo. Dynamic duo, I wouldn't say that. I was flat. I would say I'm lucky because everything she came in my lap. And I did it, and this day, although cash is not flowing in, we're still as blessed and we're growing. The exposure is all, all up there, so it's just about a matter of getting the marketing done and finally being up there. So you need, you need to talk to the manager and tell him to push you guys some more. Don't forget to tell him, you know, to promote your stuff, right? <laughs> yeah, he would. He is doing that. He's doing that. Right, beside um, Diddy Calabo in the Jamaica Trinidad group and all that, what has been one of your more major achievements so far? Wow, performing with True Alumni Band in Jazz Festival in 2011, not 10. Oh, that was having the best of this very much. I was nerve wracked more than this actually, really more than this. But it was good. We had two shows before that at um, Casa de Abiza and Casino in Grand Bazaar. I think it's Island or something. Uh, but we have been good. Tell me about the, the, the writing of the tunes. Right? Which one of you is the, the poet? Who is the one that brings out 
all the, the melody and the words and the pending and all that. Tell me. The entire team. The entire team sits down and No, individually, down. actually individually we, we, we had songs or, or poems as we should say written before. So we will prepare. We will prepare. First time I heard the other person I want this one. You would want? Yes. Which one? Hey! So we will show you one of the cats out of the bag here tonight. But don't worry, backpack, we prying, we prying, we probing. We touching all the buttons to get information out. We bringing information to you. Let not your heart be troubled, Tobago. We will find out for sure. Right? Um, I know you guys have expectations. Right? What is your, your highest dream? What do you hope to accomplish? Where do you see yourself in say, 10 years? A professional vocalist. I would see myself as a professional vocalist. I'm not there as yet. I would not say that I'm there. I am striving for perfection and I expect to be the best I can be with all of this. That's you, but what about the group? Well, um, I mean, we'll be the best, the group. We're going to keep it together. We're going to do things professionally. We are honest people. We are not ungrateful to Tobago and we'll be the best produced group in Tobago. In Tobago. <laughs> See the grey hair man all smile with that one. You like yeah. that best produce goes. Yeah, Jambago. What about up in the future? You see you guys um carrying your group to beyond just the two of you all. You see that happening? Yes, it can happen, but you have to show commitment. This is not something you just decide to do today and tomorrow. I'll think about it. You have to keep yeah. at it to see the produce of it. Yeah. How long you been persistent at this? But as a group or at singing? Both. I have been singing since I've been nine. Um, as a group, when Kay recruited me into the band, I started to think, hey, I can really do this for money. Because usually, marketing for this kind of thing is usually kind of tough. So I wasn't really thinking anybody would have... I remember you could sing, you could, but that opened up my eyes. That experience alone, I'm grateful for it. Was a bathroom singer at nine, or he was a outdoor singer? Because everybody's a bathroom singer. Come on. If you hear me in the bathroom, your sway is heavenly water falling on me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you was um, attending to tell me something. Else. Yes, we have um, male singers back in Jamaica. We have like um, oh my. we have um, Raswani. We have Jerome. We have um, Stingapi. You know those, and we have legends of um, reggae music. You know, back in us. So we have male singers, we have male vocalists, I should say, but they are back in Jamaica. So there is where the collaboration comes in with Tobago and Jamaica. So Tobago is back back, the hottest, hypest magazine type show on the island. It's time for a short commercial break, but don't go anywhere as Backpack will be right back.